Okay, Cody, uh, talk about beating De Pierre for the first time in your career. You know what? I, I can't even describe it. I mean, we've been playing these guys since God knows when, third grade or something. I don't know. We haven't beat them ever, but it feels just amazing right now. Senior, they're state ranked, we're state ranked, and we just made shots. It was, it was unbelievable. Talk about the start of the game. You guys got up 11 4 after one, and De Pierre never really, they never got in sync on offense this whole game. And So, how important was it early on to kind of set your tone? Yeah, we've, uh, we've uh, really been talking about uh, coming out strong and uh, just putting the pedal to the metal right away so we don't have to play from behind. And that's what we did and never looked, never looked back and just kept uh, going on. With your guys' style of play, um, I've, I counted a couple times, you had a 22 pass possession, 20 pass possessions, but you score off that and then you make the peer have to play their offense and you guys play good D. How demoralizing do you think that is for the other side when you, when you do that and, and you're successful at it? It's hard enough for us to play it, but then when we score on it, it just makes it that much better and it's just demoralizing. Then we go back on defense and get another stop and then come back. It's, it's amazing. Talk about the styles. I mean, De Pierre likes to run. You guys like to work it. Did, did you feel, though, that you could put your your tempo or lack of tempo on them? It was a game of tempos, and mm -hmm. the person who won the game of tempos won, and mm -hmm. that's what happened. We slowed it down and came out with a victory. Talk about uh, you had some points tonight, but you had teammates that got some points for you, too. Oh, Luke uh, fan and I in it and, uh, yeah, Cody! Yeah! We got it. <laughs> well, my teammates. All right, that's pretty good. But uh, my teammates came out. We played a hell of a game. I don't know if I'm supposed to say that. That's okay. We came out and did what we had to do, and it's gonna feel good this weekend. Talk about what this does for you guys in the conference too, because I, this, this is a big game conference-wise. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what our record is, but uh, they're undefeated, and we came in, beat them, and now we're up there in the top of the conference. We got a big one next to. Uh, Next Friday against Boygan North, mm -hmm. if we win that, we're sitting pretty. A couple other things. Uh, De Pierre had a 31-game winning streak in conference before tonight. So it, it tells you what they've been doing as a as a program. So what does this do for you guys in the long run, too? I, honestly, I, I don't know. I mean, Coach motivated us, motivated us in practice, and they've uh, pretty much had a cakewalk through our conference oh. the entire two years, four years. I don't even know whatever he's been here. And we came out, got the W, and it's going to look really good on our resume when we sit in that seating meeting. And the final thing, when you guys get that double-digit lead on teams, it's hard to come back on you guys because the way you D it up and the way you still play off and some. How confident were you going into the fourth? You had a 15-point lead. And you know they can score, but did you did you kind of feel? Were you taking yeah, it yet? I was. I was a little nervous. I mean that that uh, winter kid. He came in. I don't know seven threes or something. We were taking quick shots and. Our guys just have to learn. If you don't have a layup, just pull it out. I mean, we have a couple guys that are sophomores in here, and we're just learning, and this is going to be a great uh, stepping stone of our season.